counts. Okay, super top secret. What you working on? Yeah. Okay, so the the March of revisions continues. It's not March, but I would like to finish well before March. Yeah. Up to the five hundred seventy first revision, getting to the tougher ones now. So this clue uh, board revision. Um, love the clue board. Every single chip on here was unavailable <laughs> for a year and a half. Yeah, what's the joke? The chips of Theseus. So like, there's boards that we have that everything's different, but it is the same board. Yeah. Um, so this one, you know, I couldn't get the NR52840 and then I couldn't get the the microphone and I couldn't get the magnetometer. And then the six DOF got discontinued. Six DOF really did get discontinued. So that got swapped out. I couldn't get the magnetometer. I was about to redesign, but the magnetometer came back into stock at a reasonable price. And then whatever, whatever, you know, eventually I was like, okay, I can I can actually get this back into stock. So this just revises the LSM six DS. 33 is now just an LSM 6 DS3, which is basically almost the same chip. Um, so a different package, but um, all the other components were available. Even the BMP 280, which was uh, unavailable for like a year, um, is available at, again, the old price, which is another thing. It's like for the, this clue board, for me to be able to sell at the price, I can't be spending $5 on a magnetometer. And the pricing was really ridiculous for a bit um, but all the prices came down again and so this is being revised all the parts are being updated to the most recent versions i'll get it back in the store what else are you working on um ditto with the feather sense i know people really like the feather sense board and believe me i wanted to stock it for a while but likewise almost every sensor got discontinued actually another thing is the apds 9660 that got discontinued too but we did a last time buy i think we have enough for a couple of years so i think it's worth it you know, instead of doing a re 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 redesign, I guess I'm going to get it good enough to put it back in the shop, buy me a year, and then in a year when I, when more parts are like really discontinued, uh, cleared out. I think a lot of things that were unavailable were being held by companies. I don't want to use the word hoarded, but like kind of, sort of. Yeah. Um, and they stock got we released. So like, you know, whereas it before, I was like, I couldn't get any chips. Suddenly there's like 100,000 of them in stock. Um, yeah. So, you know, it's working out. Yeah, what's funny is that when I tell people that aren't in our industry about this, they're like, oh, yeah, like, I needed a part for my car. And they said it's going to be four years. Like, it was like, it, it it impacted everyone in so many weird ways. But it is over now, for the most part. So allowing us to do a lot of stuff. That's top secret. You'll see more in upcoming episodes of Ask an Engineer.